This is the blood-brain barrier. It supplies the brain with nutrients and protects it from harmful pathogens, toxins, and immune cells. It comprises endothelial cells forming the capillary wall with parasites, neurons, and astrocyte end feet and sheathing the capillaries. Endothelial cells form tight junctions, restricting the passage of dangerous substances from the bloodstream to the central nervous system. Vascular NMDA receptors comprising glycine and glutamate subunits are expressed on the endothelial cells, regulating the blood-brain barrier permeability in consort with tight junctions. In the pathophysiology of several neurological diseases such as ischemic stroke, multiple sclerosis, and Parkinson's disease, local glutamate levels induce an increased permeability of the blood-brain barrier via NMDA receptor-mediated signals exacerbated by overexpressed tissue plasminogen activator binding to the gluN1 subunit of NMDA receptors and triggering their overactivation. As a result, intracellular calcium and nitric oxide levels increase, matrix metalloproteinase and rho kinase are upregulated, and phosphorylation of cytoskeleton and tight junction proteins result in their degradation. This elicits blood-brain barrier disruption allowing immune cells to infiltrate the brain parenchyma. This leads to neuroinflammation, a primary cause of neuronal cell death. Lease Therapeutics is developing a monoclonal antibody to counteract these mechanisms by specifically preventing the binding of TPA on the gluN1 subunit without blocking the physiological function of NMDA receptors. By inhibiting this interaction, NMDA receptors can operate normally, haltering downstream deleterious pathways. Tight junctions are re-established. Endothelial cells return to their healthy state and blood-brain barrier function is restored, protecting the brain from further neuroinflammatory and subsequent neurodegenerative cascades. This is a revolutionary approach to treating neurological diseases. Lease Therapeutics targeting neuroinflammation to tackle neurodegeneration.